This is me as a baby, and this is my wonderful mother who has raised me to be the little rascal that I am now, sacrificing a lot for me, and has been my number one supporter since I started making YouTube videos. So, I decided to surprise her with a dream trip to Dubai, including a stay at the most ultra luxurious experiential resort in the world. Take this. No, 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 bro. Please, please. No, 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 no. this is free for you. I greeted her at the airport and showed her surprise number one out of six. I've rented a Tesla for two oh. weeks, yeah. <laughs> and we kicked things off with an early morning hot air balloon ride in the desert. Today, I'm going to be going on a hot air balloon in Dubai, 3,000 feet up. But first, we had to drive into the desert for sunrise. We had a drone show that was unexpected and then breakfast and we were on our way up into the sky. So they're just blowing it up with cold air and then we're gonna fill it up with hot air so they're gonna blow fire into it. You can see how big it is in person and we gotta climb in that. <laughs> it's just crazy. It's okay, we're going. Ready, mum? Run, run! Okay, okay, we're gonna go quickly. Yeah. You gotta be quick. The flame throwers. The only thing that's keeping us down right now is a Toyota car. And we're off. We're off. How are you navigating? Like, I don't know, it's my first time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brilliant. Yeah, so you can't really navigate with a balloon. Yeah. You just do whatever the, the wind's doing. So this morning, hold on a second, I'm just going to do something a bit more. The sun, sun is just about to come up and now we're over the sun. What the Dubai view. desert conservation. So we're going to see gazelles, we're going to see oryx, maybe some lions, giraffes. No, I'm joking about the last two, we won't see them. I didn't know what to expect, but that was an incredible experience. It's not over yet. You made it? Oh, yeah. And then we're going to come into land just over there. So, we're finished. Um, Mum, if you can just pay, pay me later, just send me the money to my bank account. And uh, no, I'm, I'm only joking. Oh, Ronald. See the logo of the That's so kind, you didn't have to. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Is there some, you some can keep it for you. red wine in here? <laughs> no, but you can put it when you go oh, back to okay. the counter. <laughs> How are you? I'm very good. Good. I'm good, thank you. <coughs> wow. Where are you from? I'm from Japan. Ah, Ogenki Deska. Genki <laughs> Desu. <laughs> What's his name? His name is Pikachu. Ah, Pikachu. Oh, <laughs> What's the thing on his head for? So, so he's not like, getting angry or? He's very sensitive to information from their eyesight. Ah. So we use this one to keep calm down and relax. Uh huh. Because no otherwise he'll him. he'll spot the eggs yeah. and he'll yeah. want to go eat the eggs. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Mm. Wow. If you want, you can bring closer. Like this. Your arm. Hello, yes. buddy. Hello. Hello, Pikachu. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Does he speak Arabic or Japanese? Oh, maybe Japanese. His okay. name is Pikachu. Okay. <laughs> Ogenki desu ka? Okay. Hey, hello. Hello. <laughs> and last but not least, the camel riding. Salam alaikum. Salam. Kif halak? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah? Yes. Can I ride the camel? Yes. Oh, here we go. Show us, Mark. Rashid. Rashid. Show us, Mark. Good name. Uh, it's me, Harry. <laughs> You're from, uh, I'm from Pakistan, but I think oh. I see you some videos. I think. Right? Oh, I thought you were Emirati. <laughs> no, you're uh, YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. G G. In Pakistan. G G G. Shukriya bhai. Shukriya bhai. Go to the saloon. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was Emirati, I started speaking Arabic. He's Pakistani, he's a Baisab. <laughs> yeah, Baisab. <laughs> uh, nice to meet yeah, you, Nice to meet you, Allah. Okay. <laughs> nice to meet you. So, yeah. What are the names? Yeah, this one, Spin, this one, Karo. Spin? In Karo. Hello, buddy. Nice to meet you. Are these the racing camels? Uh, this one, the rejected racing camel, is the beginning. Oh. Of the so, take seat. 
specs it is better. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Wow, well, I got a nice, uh, he's very good looking, yeah. nice blonde. Okay, hold on. Yeah. So you bring your mom in this uh, time with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're on holiday. Whoa! Yeah. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Well, well, so much happy to see. <laughs> and you, brother. Nice to meet you. We're getting the full UAE experience, mum. Yeah. It's funny. I've not been horse riding many times, but I've been camel riding more than I've been horse riding. We're coming into park, boys. There oh. you go. <laughs> there we go. Wow. Oh, very smooth. Very smooth. <laughs> Harish is yes. going to hook us up with the uh, traditional, what do you call this one? Gutra. Gutra. Yeah. So people are going to think I'm the sheikh of, yes. of the UAE now? Yes. <laughs> now we're starting off with a little bit of dune racing and the desert safari has started. How many years have you been doing this job? I'm doing uh, with this company two years. Two years, nice. Yes. Wow. This is the national park of UAE. We're going to see the Oryx? Yeah, we're going to see the Oryx now, oh. on the right side of this uh, fence okay. area. This is the national animal of UAE. The national animal okay. of UAE. See, my, my headdress is getting everywhere. Back then, of course, technology wasn't there, right? So the only thing that they had was like entertainment, like drummings, and of course, food. So today or tonight, we're actually serving you something which is called lamb uzi. The reason why I'm asking you to come close and have a look over here is because in this tin can on this area right here is where we're actually cooking the lamb. It can be lamb, it can be even a camel too, but it doesn't really matter. But what really matters most is that they are always going to be feeding you a lot. And by a lot, we really mean a lot that you cannot sometimes walk. Uh, after your meal because you're too full right first time trying camel meat in Dubai let's see what it tastes like mm. it's got this nice sauce so it does taste good it's a little bit chewy it tastes similar to like lamb it's nice all right we're just finishing off the evening with some stargazing and as you can see everyone's chilling we've got the traditional uh, emirati souvenir and uh, yeah it's been an amazing time definitely would recommend it had a had a very enjoyable evening very calm very professional staff have been very friendly i would definitely recommend it if you're going to go with anyone definitely go with platinum heritage because it's like the most luxurious and it's all ecotourism and it's authentic and me for me the number one thing is the authenticity this is the real uae culture if you do the other desert safaris it's not very authentic so yeah enjoying it very peaceful end to the evening i just want to briefly pause the video and talk about my number one tip for travel and that is to get an eSIM. I've talked about it loads and I've been using eSIMs for roughly around a year and the reason why is because you save so much time and money. It's so convenient. I literally have data, I have internet as soon as I land in the country. I don't have to waste time buying the local SIM which takes ages, they try and scam you I have internet straight away. I can get a taxi straight away. It's so convenient and you save money with the data roaming. My eSIM of choice is Maya Mobile. They nearly have every country in the world and it takes around five minutes to set up. It's all online. You have regional plans or you have multiple countries included in the price. What I love about this is how easy it is. It's so easy. You can add new countries, check your data, top up. Having data is so important because you need to be safe, especially when you're going to foreign countries. You've got to let your parents know when you've arrived in the country. You've got to get an Uber. I cannot recommend this enough. It's a lifesaver. And so if you want to find Maya Mobile, then go to the link in the description or the pinned comment and you'll find them at maya.net. The other thing about this car, mum, which is quite good, is the acceleration. Oh God. Please don't do that. <laughs> Please.
<laughs> like this. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> the beautiful thing about having a Tesla is that you can vlog and drive. So right now, I am like we've got the auto steer feature on, and we're just driving to the destination. I do have to occasionally touch the steering wheel. I think I got this car as a rental car from Yeti Car Rentals. Um, I basically have got it for two weeks. I got it as soon as I arrived. I went to go pick it up. It was seamless. I have completely fully insured. Uh, at, like if I do crash, inshallah, I don't. Then I just have to pay like maximum a thousand dollars or something like that. So if you're gonna come to Dubai and rent a car, it doesn't have to be a Tesla. But I just got the best one because I'm treating myself. I don't actually own a car, so I thought I'd just. Rent a nice car. The next surprise is a unique glamping experience in the Arabian dunes and then we were back up in the sky for dinner. So first time in the desert mum? Yes, first time. It's a little bit different to England isn't it? <laughs> this is the map. I feel like I'm at Disneyland again. We've got the boys. Hello. How are you? You good? Have you? a seat. Oh here we go. Yeah, We've got the good. Ferrari. Yeah, Ferrari. Is this your Ferrari? Yeah, Land, Land Rover. Oh, Land Rover. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're on our way. Look at this little oasis. There's patches of green everywhere. The best view of this month. Thank you, brother. Where are you from? I'm from Cameroon. Cameroon? Yeah, you oh. guys? Uh, England. Oh, England. <laughs> Thank you so much, brother. All right, I'm going to surprise you guys from your room. Oh, right, I'm yeah. ready. Right. You can give me with this. This is for you, brother. Right. <laughs> guys, we have just checked into the villa. As you can tell by the sound of the music, this is an adults-only hotel. It's a vibe. It's a big beach club. These are all just guests who have paid for the day. And then we have our own little pool here, which is insane. We have our own sofa, and there's lots of these villas. Let me go inside so you can actually hear me. Because it's, it's like a proper party out there. You're gonna have to order a bottle of wine in a minute and get, get partying, but this is the vibe inside. Um, just a double bed, very nice, like almost like Balinese style refreshments. The complimentary refreshments, which is really nice. So it's some, some free stuffed dates. What is that? Mm, wow. Oh, it's got chocolate in it. Ooh. We can reserve one of these for free if we want. You can reserve these, They're like literally on the water. DJ decks over there. Oh, you gotta love Dubai. Dubai is one of a kind. I'm about to have dinner in the sky here in Dubai. We're about to go 50 meters up, all the way up there into the sky and have a three course meal. Let's go. We got the boys. Namaskar. How are you? I know you. Up can say. You're one YouTuber. You're from India? No, I'm from India. Bangladesh, Bangladesh. India. Bangladesh. Bangladesh. Okay. Come on at you. Namaskar. Come on at you. Here we go. We're getting strapped in. You gotta make sure nothing's loose. So this is the menu. We've got three courses coming up. We got meze, we got ribs. Cheesecake, and then my mum's got different, so we can try everything. This is Jubair from Bangladesh. From Bangladesh, come on, Acha. Good. good, good, good. Four, three, two, one. Oh, I want to get off. I want to get off. <laughs> We've got a beach club right below us. We've got an actual really long beach just there. And then we've got skyscrapers behind us. And also the Dubai Eye over there. Wow, so we got a little bit of hummus, a little bit of uh, lebane, this is salad, and then some bread. It's like Lebanese, Arabic mix. It's a good starter. It's so windy. How's it, Mum? Thank you. Are you not, are you, does it feel weird being in the sky? It does. You look down. Yeah. Uh, this is our. Uh, Phone B of uh, dinner in the sky. Oh, oh you're natural on camera. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to rotate my camera into oh, like seaside. This is our uh, 360 view and dinner in the sky. And this is our head chef here. Hello, chef. Hi. Oh, wow. Here we go. Good interview now. So just behind me we've got JBR Beach. I used to live in that building just over there. 
far as making YouTube videos. We've got a birthday party over there. And perfect time for sunset. Donny Vaughn. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, brother. Nice to meet you. Of course, I had to show my mum old Dubai. This is where you get transported into what Dubai used to be like, and you get to experience the hospitality of the workers there. Hello, boss. How are you? How are you? It's one dirham? Yeah. Acha. All right. These are the old boats that they've used in the UAE forever. And it's also public transportation. So we're going to the other side to show the old side of Dubai. So this is an activity that most tourists usually don't come and do. They just go to the Burj Khalifa, they do the shopping mall, but they never come and see the old part of Dubai, which I would recommend. This is where Dubai started. It was a small fishing village, maybe 30 years ago, and it's grown into a huge mega city. Should we buy? And we're off. We have arrived in old Dubai. This is my mum's first time in the old Dubai. So we've got to teach her a little bit about negotiating and haggling. So you've got to just keep walking. And if they come up to you and try and say something, you've got to say, Nay chai yeah, by yourself. We're going to work on it. Strong. Oh, <laughs> holy. Is that, are you sure that's not drugs? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. Oh, Namaskar, oh, bye. Pakistani? Ah, Pakistani. Acha. Acha. <laughs> the way, okay. I've got a video in Karachi, I've got a jacket in Karachi. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. You speak Pashto also? Yeah. Singer, yeah, Haji Sab. How are you, good? I'm good, I'm good. We can see you in all video in Thank you, brother. I'm with my I'm with my mum. Oh, no. She's, oh, mom, yeah. she's been she, taken. She's outside. She's outside. Okay. She's okay, there you go. So let's come then. Uh, when you finish, then come to our shop. You're gonna give me the bicep discount? Yeah, why not? <laughs> okay, yes. Danny, bye bye. I don't know if I, I need anything from your shop. Well, okay, just you think this will fit me? I also want to buy, I'm gonna buy a hijab for my mom. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you just buy it, okay? I'm you. You will make you shit at the way, princess. Yeah, make you the bad princess, okay? Yes. How much for this one, boss? You need this one, sir? Yeah. Uh, let me ask my boss, and sir, she, uh, he needs this money, one. money, boss. <laughs> for you, it's free, bro. Are you free, sure? Of course. Yeah, because yeah, you yeah. go to Afghanistan, you and like you the explore, PayPal yeah. deals, you know, you support so much Afghan PayPal, so that's why everything's for you, free. Everything you like. Any, 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 any kind of free. Oh, everything. everything. Okay, yeah, yeah. Free. I'll take the whole shop. <laughs> okay. No problem, you can yeah. take it. You know, we are from Chalo. the land of... Uh, <laughs> the land of giving. Giving, yes. Yeah. Hospitality. So, hospitality. Do you need any things from here, so, you know, just from the bar? I need, like, uh, a wife. A wife? Yourself? No. Oh, this is a complicated question. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do this. Okay. Otherwise, you need anything. So no, it's okay. Thank you so much. Yes, That's so kind. This is a special gift for you. Thank yeah. you. Free? Yeah. All right. Where are you from? Afghanistan. Cheto Asti, by the way. Asti, Bakhar. Test, test this. Your mom? It's free? Yes, it's my yes. mom. Come on, it's free. <laughs> for you. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Oh, this is a good thing about being a YouTuber yeah. when you come to old Dubai. Yeah. Three. Oh, wow. What's this? This is dates with almond, with oh. chocolate, with biscuit. Try it. I love that. Thank you. Thank you. I seen all your video when you been you, to brother. Afghanistan. Oh, <laughs> I love Afghanistan. Yeah, it's good. Wow. Clean everything. It's this really is nice. Af Afghani or? Uh, no, this made here. Oh, okay. Yes, it's like a biscuit. Mm. They have biscuit cover in almond with dates. You know, like. Wow. Oh, so nice. Now I know why you give it yeah. for free, because yeah. you know we're going to get some more. You're a good salesman. No, I'm not selling, i just giving you. No, 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 I will pay. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone wants to give it for free. And you, if you like something from here, I can give you. No, no, let no, me No, no, you me don't pay. have to pay. I give you something. No, no, I, like. want, I want to pay. Just, just, just present for you. No. Bro. This is the Afghani hospitality. Take this. No, 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 bro. Please, please. This for you. I give good perfume for you and for your mom. <laughs> Everything is fine? Everything's great. How are you? Welcome. Hey, whoa, he's pretty he's dragging me in. He's dragging me in. Ah, ah, ah. Can I have uh, do you have whoa oh wow it's, it's Christmas. Good. Whoa. Last time you've been to Afghanistan, yeah? You got some diamonds in here? <laughs> and you're from India? India, yeah. Ah, okay, I can tell. India, Afghanistan, Pakistan. Well Afghanistan here, but I live in Pakistan. Which is the best country? <laughs> okay, good answer. Um, I want to get the Arabic writing. I think the name cutting. Yes. Yeah. I think this. So yeah, can I get a bracelet? Yeah. With the Arabic 
Yes. You can do my name? Yeah. Or maybe your name? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Get my name. Yes, please. How much is that? Kidna pesa. Can I pay in Pakistani rupees? <laughs> both country, which country uh, oh, I cannot say, brother. I cannot no, say. <laughs> no, you say. You I'll say the, the Afghani hospitality, the Indian food, oh, and the Pakistani the nature. Yeah? yeah? So all countries are best. Thank you. And England, nothing. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> England for the opportunities. Thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. Shokriya, bye. Harry, you can translate it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how to do it in Arabic. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm still learning. Harry. So they're going to basically translate it into Arabic and then make it. Yes, make it into a, a bracelet. Arabic. G. Ah, Okay. Where are you Here. India. Which state? Kerala. Ah, she so speaks Malayalam. Ah, Malayalam. Malayalam. Oh! <laughs> Everyone knows you because we are all coming to see. <laughs> Salaam alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. You go for Pakistan. G. You can have a beach. G. How do you write? my boss. Dani Wad Bai. Three fifty. Give a round figure. Three fifty. There. You can yeah, do three two five. Sorry, sir. Three two five. I give already good. Price. Look at that. I get a bit with basic three hundred fifty. Give you okay. Three hundred fifty. Okay. You got it. I'll make okay. Can I pay by card? Yeah, you can pay okay. card. It's the Amazon Prime delivery, <laughs> the yeah. Bicep delivery. Wow. And this is like real. Thank you so much. Harry in Arabic. Or maybe it's Urdu. Or Hindi. <laughs> yeah, true. My subscribers will know. So, you guys, can you read that for me? Because I don't know what that says. Here we go. Oh no, I, you don't have to. No, no, it's okay. There's chocolate. This is for your gift. No, I'll, I'll pay for that. No, Not for <laughs> no, brother. Let me give you. This let, for you, okay? No, let me give no, you no. some money. No, 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 no. no this no, is no, free no. for you. This <laughs> gift for you. Oh my god! I'm at the world's only seven-star hotel in Dubai, and I'm going to have a 24-karat gold coffee. Let's see how much it costs. Oh, here we go. This is my first time entering. A seven star hotel. Oh my god. Wow. As soon as you enter, there's like bright colors everywhere. Look at this carpet. So, this is just the entrance, and you can just see this is the most unique design ever. Red sofas, colorful carpet, fountains that I've never seen. This is like extra, ultra, extravagant luxury that you just can't find anywhere else in the world. Only in Dubai. Look at this gold everywhere gold floor, gold walls, gold doors. Hello, assalamu alaikum. I'm good, how are you? We have a reservation for of two course. people. So basically, there's lots of different things you can book here. The cheapest way to book it is to, literally just to do the a la carte. So you have to minimum spend is 200. This is the menu. Not sure if you can see very well. So basically, we're gonna get a coffee and a cake for 200 AD. But it's not just any coffee, it's a gold cappuccino. I think we're both going to get the what gold cappuccino? Gold cappuccino. Is it real gold? It is 24 karat gold. No way. It so is. I, I'm just going to go and take it and sell it at the, at the, at the gold souk. Where are you from? Indonesia. Ah, oh, Apakaba. Siapa <laughs> namu? You really can speak Bahasa. I, I live in oh, Bali. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Da Dari Mana? Dari Java. Java. Uh, yeah. How hard was it to get the job here? Actually, it's not quite hard as long as if you have the experience first. Because oh. since I, when I was in Indonesia, I was working already in the hospitality. Yeah. So, wow. Yeah. You must be. Your parents must be so proud that you're working here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They, yeah. Even though it is hard. Here we go, guys. We have a 24 karat gold cappuccino i'm not too sure what this sign is i think it might be the sign of the restaurant we also have a uh, a marshmallow with some 24 karat gold on there it's like maybe i can just put this in my bag and take it to the nearest gold shop and then we have this amazing chocolate dessert which she's chosen for me and my mum got the mango dessert which also looks delicious imagine if i accidentally spilt it here we go <gasps> 
It tastes just like any other coffee I've ever had. <laughs> I want my money back. Look at this. It's like a flower. A little bit of gold on there. This is the most expensive chocolate cake I've ever had. But it's good. Mum reaction? Nice coffee. Because because I, I paid quite a lot for this, Mum. Can you just do like a fake? Can you just cry or something on camera? Because we need to make the money back. Can you cry? <laughs> You're gonna have to hit me. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> this is just so amazing. So all of this came to 400 AED, which is not cheap at all, but you're paying for the ambiance, the experience, and just to say that you've had a, a gold coffee. It's a bit extra, but this is, uh, this is Dubai for you. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're a few days into the holiday, and it's time to tell you about the biggest surprise. The biggest and the best surprise. Are you ready? We are going skydiving. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No, no, no. No, no. I, I know. No, you wouldn't do that to me. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> okay, I'm being serious that. now. No. It's basically a hotel that has the deepest scuba diving in the world and it's like um, 100 meters down. I oh, know, you're joking. Are oh, you joking? That's my idea of a nightmare. <laughs> no, I'm joking. You're not going. <laughs> Wait, okay, I'll be serious now. <sighs> Bungee jumping. No, I'm joking. No, no. We are staying at the world, officially the world's most luxurious experiential resort, the new Atlantis Royal. Wow. Cristiano See, Ronaldo. Now, now you're talking. <laughs> but you have to skydive to get there. Yeah, yeah. Last but not least, we checked into the Atlantis Royal Resort, which cost me an eye-watering $2,500 for two nights. The most expensive room goes for over $100,000 per night and it costs over $1 billion to make. Hello boss, good morning. I'm good, how are you? Ah, we're, thank you. Checking we're checking in, in. yes. Right, please allow me to take this one. So welcome, by any chance you would like to have water? We have a sparkling or a steel? Steel, please. Here we go. I'm expecting a firework display as I enter. This is the king bed with the view of the palm. First impressions is it's a very spacious hotel room. I feel like we've got a slightly larger hotel room than I'm, than I'm used to. An amazing bath I'll take you through and views of the palm. Coming into the bathroom, look at this. A huge marble bathroom, a big bath. Look at this scrubber. Can I take this scrubber home, you reckon? I wonder if I can take this home. Yes. I'll be using this tonight with some bath salt. Very modern. They've come, come the room comes with the Voss water. Very extra. Look at, look at this. Golden plated shavers, toothbrush, shaving cream, mouthwash even. All Atlantis Royale branded. Body lotion. Very, very grand. Let's just check out. Oh wow. They've even got like little tags to explain what's going on. The the bathroom of dreams with with an out loud speaker so I can speak to the guest services. If I have an emergency, maybe I have terrible diarrhea, then I can call an emergency. Um, and then coming into the, the shower of dreams. This is the shower. We've got a nice rainfall shower and a normal shower head here. We've also got Graf. Uh, never heard of them, but probably is a nice brand and then everything's electric so we can also use like different lighting here coming into the the main king bed let's test it out it's soft it's good nice pillows i mean bed's a bed how how good can a bed be it's not memory foam so don't get excited huge uh tv here look at this and coming over here i mean this is something you would expect in a in a five star hotel, but that very nice Nespresso machine. Even just the little things like they've added a little skin. Uh, we've got obviously the coffee, lots of different types of tea. We've got a big bottle of Voss there, another kettle. This is very nice cutlery and plates and whatnot. Now this is going to be interesting. What have we got in the mini bar of dreams? Oh wow, yes. You can drink alcohol in Dubai. It is a thing. Oh, it's very much a thing. 
And uh, I wonder how much these are. We'll find out in a second. They've even got Starbucks Frappuccino. This is probably the best selection of minibar items I've ever seen. Um, but unfortunately, wait till you see the prices. TV's pretty cool. And the PS de resistance of this place is the balcony because we get views of the palm and we get mother enjoying the views. What do you think? I'm lost for words. It's, they've just done the show, the water show. Oh, fantastic. Here we go, guys. We've got the views of the palm. We've got Dubai Marina, we've got JBR. We've got the Burj Al Arab and the Burj Khalifa over there. But it's a bit misty today. And the water park that we'll be going to, the aquarium we'll be going to, and then we've got three different pools. We've got a fountain show. We've got so much more to discover from this place. So this is pool number one, the family pool. We're gonna avoid this pool because okay. I don't wanna be hanging around with all the kids. We're gonna go to the other pool. There's three pools here. So this is the, the beach, the private beach. We've got people's villas over there. I feel like I can just swim to their villa. Maybe I can go and swim to Ronaldo's villa and go and say hi. And this is the third pool. Adults only, so it's a lot more chilled. Feels like a bit of a beach club here. And included in the Atlantis Royale, we have Aquaventure. It's a water park that you usually have to pay extra for. I'm not too sure the price, but we'll find out. And we're gonna get free entry. We're about to do a ride with my mother. Honda Machan. Honda How you recommend that from Sri Lanka? Sunshine Hunja. I know you. I know you. Bye bye. Thank you. See you, Kada. Thank you. Where are you from, Anna? Ah, Abkhaz. Abkhaz, Yeah, I'm from India. Which state? Uh, Where? Delhi. Ah, nice. What's your favorite thing about India? Uh, I, like the, I like the food, I like the culture. What's your favorite thing about Dubai? Uh, it's very really fun here. Very what? Really fun here. Really fun. Yeah. Very good. You got very good, very good English. All right, and we're off. We've come to the old Atlantis. Here we go, the Lost Chambers Aquarium. So this is the aquarium inside the old Atlantis Hotel. It's interesting, it's not crazy, nothing special, but it's nice to get it for free. Last surprise, Mum. Yeah. Last surprise is no. we're going swimming no. in there. No. It's part of the experience, you have to, no. to get to your room. And of course, like every attraction, there's always a gift shop and you have to pay more for photos. So it feels like at this point everything's a bit of a money grab, but you don't have to buy anything. I kind of want to buy this turtle to be honest. So this is the top floor of the Atlantis. It looks like a little plunge pool. You can get these cabanas and you can get these beds. Hello boss, how are you? How are you? Good. <laughs> so as you can see, I'm not in my swimming gear. And that's because it costs $150 to swim at the pool when I could just go downstairs and swim down there. So I'm just gonna have drinks, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, this is a bit of a negative from my side is that I feel like there's a paywall behind everything. To use the steam room and the sauna, pay, you have to pay for that. To use the pool, you have to pay for that. It seems a bit strange, but hey, I'm still enjoying it. I'm still having fun. Are you having fun, Mum? Oh, yeah. Is this good enough? I know you're like you have high expectations. Are you sure? Are you sure this is good enough? <laughs> this is another level. <laughs> okay. Just look at that view. I know, but I think this view is better. Hello. Hello. How are you? How are you? Good. 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 Uh, this is our menu. Just uh, if you want to take a look, and you already ordered the water, right? Yes. Okay, it's coming. Thank, Thank you so you much. Very much. This is a Dolce. I don't know this brand, but Dolce and Gabbana with collaboration with Unas for the menu. I didn't know Dolce and Gabbana did food. We were just sitting down having our drinks and started the conversation with this uh, Mexican lady. She's giving me recommendations for Mexico. She's gone off to make a list for me. Oaxaca and Yucatan. Okay. More in Yucatan. Okay, perfect. Okay. Gracias. De nada. Como te llamas? Andrea. Andrea. Yes. Nice to meet you. Nice Thank you so much. You. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. Hello, boss. 
I would like the best Thai food you have. Thai food. Thai Thai. Yes, please, sir. This is the boat, we, the private boat we get to the Thai restaurant. I've never got a boat to a restaurant before. Sorry? Pai Thai restaurant. Pai Thai, yes, please. Where are you from, brother? Bangladesh. Oh, come on, Acha. Hey, you're from where? I'm from England, Ben England, England. Sir. Ah, okay, yeah. okay. Abna okay. Namki? One Nam Razu. Razu. Yeah. Salam alaikum, Razu. You're the, bo you're the boat driver? Yeah, yeah. Can I drive? You can try only here. They okay. Me, yeah. I'm, I have my license. Really? Oh my god, he's actually letting me drive. I probably shouldn't be doing this. <laughs> okay, thank you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Razu. We've arrived at Pai Thai. You're from Philippines. Come on, the car. Wow, look at this. Thank you so much. Here we go. Dish one out of five. It's actually very similar to Pani. Tastes good. Mm. Oh my god. The main course has arrived. We have sea bass, we have uh, beef, we have uh, prawn. Uh, green curry and I'm not sure what that is but rice. I will go for the green curry. This is probably my favorite dish. Either this or masama. Mm, green curry, you can never go wrong. It's like a masaman curry sauce. I think that my favorite thing about Thai food is the sauce. So much flavor. So it's a mixture of savory, sweet, hot and cold and a little bit of fruit on top. What a finish to a delicious meal. I'm stuffed. I'm ready to go home and pass out. Thank you, brother. 690. This was for sure the most extravagant holiday I've ever been on. Dubai has its positives and negatives, but for sure I had a good time. I will leave links in the description to book these activities if you want. And thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.